How's it going everyone? Lucian Sword here playing some more Brawlhalla for you today. As always, I hope you are all having a beautiful day wherever you guys might be. So today is exciting because it is the start of a brand new series I'm doing. Tin rank to diamond rank in Brawlhalla. It's going to be a long journey, but this is the very start of it. And not only am I doing tin to diamond, we're playing every single Brawlhalla legend along the way in order. So I'm going to start with Bodvar, and when I win a game, I'm going to go to the next legend. If I lose a game, I have to keep playing that legend until I get a win, even if I derank all the way back down to tin. So we're going to start it with Bodvar, tin rank. Obviously, I'm not tin three, but close enough. And honestly, you, even a brand new account starts at silver rank, which is 1200 elo. So uh, yeah, we're actually way negative than even a brand new account would start. So I didn't really want to go all the way to like tin three or whatever. I don't think you guys will mind. So here we go, guys. Tin to diamond using every Brawlhalla legend. If you guys think this is going to be an awesome series, go ahead and drop a like and be sure to subscribe to catch all the other videos. All right, so a little bit of context. If you're new to my channel, I am a 23 time diamond in Brawlhalla 1v1, meaning I've I've played Brawlhalla a long time since it was in beta. I've got I've played every single season and I've been diamond every single time pretty much. So um, this is a rank that I am much, much higher than most people would call this smurfing. And it is smurfing, but I don't normally uh, make a habit of smurfing. I actually frown upon it because it's not fair and um, it's not fun for the other person pretty much. But this video is for educational purposes. I've, I just really have never done this on my channel before where I went from the lowest rank to the highest rank. You know what I mean? I just wanted to see what it was like. And so here we are. And I've also never done it using every Brawlhalla character in the game. So I hope you guys appreciate this. And don't call me a smurf because that's not what I'm trying to show. This guy, see what I mean? Like for, for a tin rank, he's actually not terrible. Like, I mean, I, I don't know. I guess I've never really played tin rank much, but I mean, he's damaging me. I'm in orange. I think at this rank, it pretty much is like you don't want to jump. You don't want to dodge that much in tin rank. People just tend not to dodge and they tend not to know how to get back on stage either so oh, I was actually trying to help him back up all right the journey to diamond begins we won with Bodvar so we're moving on to Cassidy now unfortunately as you can see I am playing on my alt account or one of my alt accounts and I don't really have a lot of skins on this account I do have some some skins I just don't remember like which legends they're for because I never play on this account I made it years ago, just so I could go undercover and not be known, you know? But then I thought, you know what? If I'm gonna start at 10 rank, I don't wanna derank my main account all the way to 10. I'll just uh, use my alt account, and then once we get to like gold or platinum rank, then I'll use my main account. All right, here we go. Game number two on our road to diamond. So hopefully in this episode, I don't know how long it's gonna be, but we're starting at 10. So hopefully we'll get to, to at least like halfway through bronze or maybe even all the way to silver in this episode. We'll see. I always let the opponent get a weapon even in diamond rank. It doesn't really uh, matter. Okay. So a lot of people ask me like how do you beat spammers? Basically, you have to just not get hit. Which sounds easier than it, than it is I'm sure if you're not used to the game as much. But with practice, you will be able to like see where the sigs are gonna hit and you'll be able to just avoid them all right let's try some blasters see I knew where that was gonna hit so I just stayed out of distance and then I punished ow that one hit even even a, a tin can hit a diamond player with some attacks right want to see a Russian mafia Oops, that was not it. Okay, that was not it. Man, I am a little bit rusty with hammer today, huh? Woo, got him with the Russian Mafia. It wasn't even like the fastest one you could do, but I always thought that move was fun. Yeehaw! Cassidy! Cowgirl! Oh, okay. 
Another thing at this rank, yeah, they just have a hard time getting back to stage. Well played, well played. That was Cassidy. All right, moving on to Orion. Who knows, guys? I don't know, like, how many wins it's going to take to get to Diamond uh, starting at 10. Um, so I'm not sure, like, how many times I'm going to play the same legend. Let me know in the comments if you think I'm going to play every legend once, every legend twice, every legend thrice. There's like 55 legends or something like that in the game. I don't remember the exact number, but it's over 50, I'm pretty sure. All right, here we go. Orion. Orion has spear and lance. I'm going to take a sip of water. Mm. Got to stay hydrated, gamers. All right, here we go. Orion versus Zario. I'm going to go ahead and let him get a weapon, as always. All right, here we go. Didn't time that very good, but it's okay. Good old side light into neutral sig with the Orion Lance. Always works well. All right, let's try spear. That's probably game right there. Oh no, he's got one more stock, okay. See, I feel bad doing this, like, this is why you don't smurf, guys. It's kind of a bully thing to do. But now you guys can see what it's like for a diamond to play in 10, I guess. And we're going to go all the way to diamond. Diamond to diamond, baby. Or 10 to diamond, but yeah, you know what I mean. Let's do a uh, side light. Yeah. Let's try doing some gravity cancels. Ooh, careful there, buddy. Let's do like side light, neutral air, gravity cancel, side light. Like that, except hit it, actually. <laughs> GG, dude. GG. Well played, though. I mean, he's he's a 10 rank. I feel bad. But, guys, again, I gave a ton of free elo just to get to this rank. So I'm just getting it back, basically. And look at that. We are out of 10, and we are finally in bronze. And we just won with Orion. So now we're going to lower Brax. I actually do have some different like weapons I could use, I guess, weapon skins. Let's use the Black Star and I actually like his his ray guns right here. They actually look kind of cool. All right, we're going against a fate. Our first game in bronze rank, guys. Let's at least try to get to like the middle of bronze before we end this episode. I'm not sure how many episodes it's going to take, but we will finish this series if it's the last thing I do. All right, get a weapon. There you go. All right, I'll let you get a couple hits because I forgot to give you a free weapon. All right, come on. There you go. All right, there you go. Bye-bye. Blasters are really good against new players because they just have no idea, like, how to fight it. But I guess that's probably true with almost every weapon. I'm not doing that great, but obviously I don't really have to at this rank. Pop goes the weasel. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, he's still alive. Maybe I should have done one more boom. Never mind, we got him. GG, dude, GG. Well played, well played. All right, that was Lord Vrax. Keeping it moving, let's go to Nash. Here we go. Another Zariel. Not surprised because for some reason, low level people. I actually like Zariel a lot. Like, I like every legend, guys. I like a lot of people ask what is my favorite legend, but I like every legend a lot. Um, so, like, some I do like more than others, but Zariel's a good legend. And uh, for some reason, new players really like to use Zariel because he has good signatures like that. But. We should be able to uh, handle the bow spam if we uh, just hit him a few times. 
hammer is such a good weapon, man. Don't go for the weapon. Ooh, he actually didn't. What? Okay, you die for that. You got side sig side sig me. I'm gonna side sig you right back. I love this map, the Ninja Turtles. I want another Teenage Ninja Turtle crossover, but with Shredder. Boom. 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 I love doing that move. Nash is super underrated. First time I ever got to Diamond in 1v1 ever was actually I was using Nash. But that was a long time ago. I've gotten to Diamond with many different characters. GG, dude. GG. Well played. And that was Nash. We're going to keep it going fast because I want to get through bronze, guys. Things are going to start getting interesting once we get to gold rank, probably. Then you get people that actually know how to dodge and stuff. So we'll see. That's what I want. That's kind of why I wanted to do this, so we could see like what the difference is. Like, it's hard to tell kind of when you're stuck in a rank, but if you can see each rank and see what it's like to progress from each rank, you can kind of see what you're going against. I could uh, just completely bully him and right here, yeah, and not let him get back to stage because he doesn't know how to dodge. Like, the biggest uh, hurdle most people face at first is just learn how to get good at dodging, basically. And um, also learn how to get back on stage a little bit better. All right, we got our first rage quit. Feels bad, but like I said, I gave a lot of people free elo just to get here. So I'm just getting it back. And hopefully I teach you guys a little bit like how to play each legend. I'm not like a pro or anything like, but I do have a lot of experience in the game and I do play all legends. I actually have black colors unlocked for every legend in the game on my main account. So like I know how to play every legend. So hopefully this will be an educational video for you guys. And if you find it useful, like I said, please drop a like. It really helps out the channel. All right, here we go. Hattori versus Koji, the battle of swordsmen. Let's go. Sword and spear versus sword and bow. I love this map too. It's like ninja versus samurai and we're on a, <laughs> and we're on an Asian map. Watch where you're throwing those side six. There we go. Oh man, he's getting a little bit better at trying to get back on stage. We are in bronze rank still, right? Here we go. Stock number two. You can dodge out of this Koji. Oh, you kind of took a while to dodge it, but you did get it eventually. Over here. Oh. All right. Final stock here. We are blazing through bronze rank as expected. Oh, how did I not grab? He don't know where to land. But you can't keep jumping on me forever. I'll take you right off the ceiling, boy. GG, GG. That was Hattori. Moving it on. We got Sir Roland. We're going to probably complete at least the first row of legends. That would actually maybe make sense for a stopping point. Instead of like which rank we're on, I might just do like one row of legends for each video. And whatever rank we're at, we're at. Because that's a lot of games, to be honest. 
We are already at like 15 minutes. All right, here we go. Slayer971. Hattori versus uh, Sir Roland, the legend we were just using. And I think she's using starlight colors, which looks really cool. I wish I had cool colors. The only downside of using an alt account, right? I don't have any skins. Oh my goodness. I actually do like Sir Roland. He's one of my better legends out of the many that there are in this game, but he's maybe not my best. Hard to tell. I'm kind of surprised that didn't hit, but... Oh, wow. She actually could have got that wall touch, I think, but... Just trying to be a little creative there. Should be game. Home run. Oh, just missed. Boom. GG, dude. GG. Sir Roland's always fun. All right, moving it right along, guys. We have Scarlet. Let's go. Scarlet is also a fun legend. Lance and Hammer, are you kidding me? Two really strong weapons. Ooh, we found a match right away. The higher rank we go, it's actually like once we get to silver and gold, I feel like we're going to find matches very quickly because that's where the majority of players are. All right, we're going against Abra playing uh, Fate. Scarlet versus Fate. I'm going to give him a, a good luck emote and then I'm going to let him get the weapon. Get the weapon, bro. I'm about to annihilate you. Don't you realize? Stop running away. It's a natural reaction, but if you're a silver or bronze rank, you gotta not run away so much because Oh wow, I killed myself. <laughs> oh well, I was trying to do a recovery and then like a dodge or like a dodge and then a recovery and I accidentally did gravity cancel. Uh, he's still running away. No, are you kidding? Okay, well, there you go. We are in bronze rank after all. And now we're going to Thatch. Don't worry guys, if you think that that game was short, I'm probably gonna play Scarlet again because I don't think we're gonna get to Diamond like going through every legend only one time from 10 because that's only like 50 wins and I don't think you can get diamond even if I won every single game I don't think you can get to diamond in only 50 wins from 10 so I'm probably gonna have to play every character more than once oh wow he's got bad manners attack me on my opening taunt did we find a smurf he's actually playing a lot better than the other legends that we've faced so far Oh, baby, maybe not. If he is a smurf, it's probably like a, a person who's normally gold trying to smurf in bronze. All right, so he rage quit. We got another rage quit and not surprising when he was the one who attacked me on opening taunt, but that's okay. I feel bad we didn't really even get to use thatch cannonballs very much, so you know what? Let's let's I, I, I gotta I gotta use the cannonballs here. First she needs to get away from me a little bit. There we go. And now she's gonna get cannonballed to death. <laughs> Alright, uh GG whoever you were who quit really fast. Now let's go to Ada. Ada was actually the first Brawlhalla legend I ever played, guys. Before I even ever knew that I liked Brawlhalla, it was just a brand new game. I didn't know if it was good or bad. I decided to give it a chance, and uh, the rest is history, as they say. But Ada was my first legend to play because I thought she looked cool. I like technology. I like this Technomancer look. And uh, she helped me learn how to play Blasters and Spear because those are her weapons. All right, apparently I've already played this guy. I don't remember. Three, 
Moonin versus Ada. I'll try to use a little bit of blasters and spear so you guys can see what it looks like for both. Well, that was enough spear, I guess. Ooh, I see what he's trying to do. He's trying to just sit there and wait until I do come close, and then he's trying to hit me with that side sig. Oh, let's get the island bounce to recovery. Watch this, watch this. Oh, I messed it up. How about again? Oh, okay, never mind. If you're cool, you can do the downlight side air into the island bounce and then recovery for the kill. But apparently I'm just not cool enough. Oof. Don't just go straight down like that. Like anybody can punish that. At least he's not quitting, like... I give him props. I don't know how I missed that. Alright, blasters are fun, but... Alright, I guess he gave up. I was gonna switch to spear, but that's alright. GG, dude, GG. We are moving really high. I'm actually... We might get to, uh... We might get to silver this video. We got four more legends to go through. Four more legends? So, if I can get to silver in... Uh, one row of legends. I wonder if the next row will get me to gold. All right, here we go. Going against it's Maz Neural three nine zero six. I love that skin he's using. Three, two, one, I'm gonna let him get a weapon as always. That is a clean looking Artemis skin. I don't care who you are. It looks good. I think it almost looks cooler than the level 3 version. It's not as busy looking, you know? Oh my goodness. That was a bully move with the hammer, but it worked. Oh my gosh. The rage quits are coming fast, faster and faster, it seems, the higher rank we go. I wonder why that is. Four. 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 Four, uh, four, four. <laughs> oh man, Sentinel's better than most people realize, guys. I'm just telling you, he's actually really fun legend to play. He has fun signatures that are really good. If you hit that down sig on top, you'll actually spike them downwards. Like, boom. See what I mean? It can be a devastating. Uh, kill move. All right, GG, dude, GG. T unfortunately, they don't even want to fight, but that's okay. If they fight all the way through, I give them mad respect. All right. Lucian, you're up. Let's get that win. Let's get silver this episode, guys. We got to make that progress. Going against Gene Bean on YouTube. He has a pink Jayun. Here we go. Check out Green, or sorry, Gene Bean on YouTube, guys. I have no idea if that's a good channel. I'm guessing he only has like one or two uploads, but I don't know. Dude, I'm letting you get a weapon. Chill. Do you want to fight me unarmed? Because that's okay if you do. Oh my gosh, I can't, can't hit anything with blasters anymore. I keep doing that all day, bro. Hold that, thank you. Just gonna keep smacking you around until you die, Jayun. and you know this. Don't quit, don't quit, don't quit. I would love it if you play the whole three game stocks, you know what I mean? If you don't like getting beat this bad, that's understandable. I, I don't think anybody does, but 
If I'm doing stuff that you've, you're not really used to doing, maybe you should watch the replay and try to copy me because I'm pretty good at getting diamonds. Okay, bye bye, Jayan. Oh, I missed. Nobody's actually taken a stock off us yet. Like, the one time I died was actually a suicide, so I don't count it. Nobody's actually just, like, killed us straight up even once yet. I wonder when the first legit stock taken will be. Probably in uh, silver rank. I'll probably mess up and take enough damage to get knocked out. I'm not trying to play flawlessly. I'm just trying to get the win at this point. Oh my goodness. GG dude, GG. Well played, well played. Oh, he wants a rematch, but no, I cannot rematch because I need to actually keep going on the legend pick. So unfortunately, sorry, I would rematch normally, but since we're doing one legend win per match, I won the game. I have to go on to the next legend. Those are the rules. Nothing against the rematch. However, if I lose, I can do a rematch because if I lose, I, I can play that legend. I have to play the legend until I win. So in fact, if I lose, it's an automatic rematch. We'll just say that. All right, here we go. Going against another Hattori. Hattori seems to be popular right now. Maybe it's just because she's in the free legend rotation. I don't know. Uh, is it one of these people that likes to fly up and then down helicopter? I can just do hammer nares all day. Hammer nares are just massive hitbox. They come out fast. Kind of hard to punish. All right. They're not really moving. I'm just going to damage her up. Is she even really trying? I mean, come on, man. I feel bad if it's like a little kid or something, but it's for science. We must move on to diamond. Whoa, dude. Those sidekicks are pretty, uh, pretty fast over there. Come on, Hattori. Face your destiny. All right. GG, dude. GG. Well played. Is that it? Do we, or do we got one more? We got one more. Last but not least, guys, Bryn. And I think this might promote us to silver. This is going to be the last match of this episode because it will be all of the top row characters. Hopefully, it's enough to get us to uh, silver. Fun fact. Uh... Nash was actually the first legend to get to diamond for me, but Bryn was actually my first like main legend, the person who I played the most and decided I want to master. Then I decided I wanted to learn every character in the game, so I just started playing all of them, but yeah, Bryn, I'll always have a soft spot for Bryn. She was my original main and my one and only main, really. I never really had a new main after her. Oh, oh, this is uh, this is, this is a bronze over here? Kind of, kind of playing like uh, not a bronze. Yeah, you get out of here. You're smurfing. Well, guess what? You ran into the ultimate smurf right now. A diamond smurf and bronze. You don't want to mess with that. Oh my goodness. All right, I'll let her get a weapon this time. You can have a uh, next weapon spawn right there. Ooh, the unarmed. All right, let's see if we got, uh, I almost said diamond. Let's see if we got silver. GG dude, GG. No? Oh my gosh. Probably one more win and we'll be silver. So anyways, I'm gonna end it there guys. We played every legend on the top row. Let me know if you guys enjoy the series and where 
you think we will end the series on? Which legend will be the final legend to get us the diamond? That'll be fun. And I like playing every legend. We're going from tin to diamond, baby. Drop a comment, drop a like, and be sure to subscribe for more Brawlhalla content as always. This is Lucian Sword. Hope to see you in the next video. Take it easy, friends.